watching Channel 2, Houston's home for news. Well, whether you saw it in the news or in your social media feeds, you've likely heard by now that Obamacare premiums will jump on average 25% next year. But what you may not know is that people in some areas will feel less of an impact from the premium hike. Health reporter Haley Hernandez live tonight with what Houstonians can expect. Haley? That's right, Dominique. So here at the uh, Denver Harbor Community Center is where they're going to be giving people free help next week once an open enrollment begins. And as you just mentioned, there are a lot of changes this year, so they expect a big turnout. Insurers are raising prices and eliminating plans on the exchange as they try to stem losses. And without having the healthy individuals sign up, it's just hard for them to maintain the lower premium. About a year ago, Angel Simmons said she had to choose between coverage or money, and her family opted to save money. Neither of us could work. We lost the house, and because um, we didn't have insurance, he kept putting off going to the doctor, and he ended up passing away in July. That's right. She blames not having insurance on her husband's death because she claims he gave up life-saving medications to gamble the savings. Now she's left still wanting insurance due to her own health problems, but cannot afford it more than ever. But if it's so expensive that you can't afford it, then what would you do? You get the gold card and if you don't live in Harris County, I guess you're screwed. Many Texans share her frustration as providers in Texas will drop by nearly half in 2017. However, a study by the Episcopal Health Foundation says Harris County residents might not face steep premium hikes because nearly 85% of enrollees here receive federal subsidies to help and that reduces premium costs by about 75%. That are like Mara Short says prices. because the marketplace is so complex, you need to reevaluate every year. And for help reevaluating, navigating those choices, again, the City Health Department says that they're going to be out at community centers next week helping you to enroll. One of them right here at Denver Harbor. This is in Northeast Houston on 6402 Market Street. Another one you can go to is 6400 High Star in Southwest Houston. For now, I'm reporting live in Northeast Houston. Haley Hernandez, KPRC Channel 2 News.